caught on video a DoorDash driver snatching a dog during a delivery in Warren. Thank you for joining us here at 6. I'm Dave Llewellyn. And I'm Carolyn Clifford. 7 Action News reporter Simon Shaykett shows us what it took to bring that pup back home. Police say that dog napper confessed to stealing a puppy here at this home as soon as they tracked her down. And they say the video in this case is compelling. Caught on video, a despicable puppy pirate with no shame. This DoorDash delivery driver hitting the door with some grub, then dashing off with Ashley Swinton's eight week old puppy. You can see her like pet the dog, rub the dog. I guess she was trying to see if the dog was vicious or anything. Then you see her scoop the dog up and take the dog directly to her car. They invited this person to deliver food to their home and trusted them to do their job. And uh, they delivered the food, but obviously took something that didn't belong to them. Just after the new year, Warren police unleashing their top detectives on the case here on Rivard near Van Dyke on a mission to find Bella the puppy. And they used this surveillance video to chase down leads. If you can take a dog, you can take someone's belongings, you can take a kid, anything like you don't just do things like that. This is a new one even for me. It's uh, pretty shocking when you watch the video and see it happen right in front of you. Tracked to the area of 11 Mile Road and Van Dyke. Detectives sniffing out their suspect with some help from DoorDash. Police say the woman they collared had no explanation except to own up to the crime. They admitted to stealing the dog. Um, I recovered the dog from the scene, still in good health and happy and returned it to the family. The 26 year old seen here lives at nearby 11 Mile and Van Dyke. As for the family that was targeted by the accused thief, there's relief knowing this won't happen to another unsuspecting customer. They were extremely shocked. They had several children in the home and it was a Christmas gift for them uh, that obviously had been taken a couple days previous and they assumed that it would never be returned. This could have been something that could have been put to the bottom of the list but they actually took the time to do good police work. The family here continues to express their gratitude to warn police for effective police work and recovering their puppy. Also, we've learned charges could be coming soon. Simon Shaykat, 7 Action News. The 